Okay, so this is just a quick little tutorial on how to get your GIMP to look like mine or have a choice in how your GIMP looks for you. The first thing that I've done is I've gone to Windows and enabled the single window mode and that puts all my windows together. Um, no more the three floating ones have separated all over the screen. And I don't know, I think this is a little more friendly to work with. But the other thing is, is that I don't have the default color scheme. And when you change your themes, lots of things change. Sometimes things are easier, some things are harder to see when you change your themes. So you do want to be careful about that and test them out a little bit. Um, how you do this is you actually download new themes into your actual GIMP um, folders on your computer. So I'm going to give you a link in the description to um, a media fire. It's from me and it has all the themes in it and all you have to do is unzip it. When you unzip it, drag and drop all of the theme folders from that zip file into your GIMP themes folder, which you can find right here. Your hard drive, username, um, users, your username, GIMP, 2.8, and themes. And when you drag and drop them in there, uh, then you're free to open up your GIMP. Um, if GIMP is already opened when you do that, you'll have to close GIMP and reopen it. Before I I'll go to that. Let me just show you. These are the themes that are in here. We have quite a few of them. Um, this one is called Acid. This one is called After Hours. And as you go through these, you can see how much you like them or dislike them. If you like chocolate, that might be good for you. This one's pretty good too. Um, creamy Acid, uh, Dark Prudence. I think that's just called Prudence. I may have named that one wrong. This one is um, just Doom 3, uh, so they're pretty cool. Some of them are a little darker, some are a little lighter. There's even a couple. This is Prudence. This one is small, and this one is actually the default one. So you can just go through these and pick the one that you want. Now, when you get those loaded into your Themes folder for GIMP, Come up to Edit and come down to Preferences. And when your Preferences open up, click on the Themes uh, tab on the left-hand side. And you'll see all of your themes listed here. And then you just pick the one that you want and you click OK. The problem with this is that um, when you click OK, the theme doesn't pop up right away. You have to close GIMP down and reopen it in order to see that theme, in order for that theme to be active. So again, that's kind of why I was showing you the preview of them. You can go back and look at them a little more to get an idea of which one you like. This one here is London Smoke. So anyways, have fun with that. Um, it's as easy as one, two, three. Thank you for watching.